President, uh, President Abba Nadir, um, to give you the last minute of um, thoughts, what, from what you've heard, as a leader of a country which depends so much on tourism, has given you hope, what has given you concern, and, and what, what kind of conclusions do you draw? I think both. <laughs> <coughs> there is concern, but I think here also they spoke about regional travel. I think that you will see in the next 18 months a lot of regional travel. Uh, you will not see transatlantic, you will not see transpacific. Uh, for example, we have seen an excellent summer for us, especially for the Americans, because they will travel less to Europe because of the concerns that they have. Uh, and at the beginning also, of the, uh, we wanted to open hotels that were closed. We started uh, financing for our, our own Dominicans without interest to go to the hotels because they had to open. So we had to be prepared for the summer, for the uh, winter of 2020, 2021, that they were gonna open half the hotels. And the, to the tourism, uh, Dominican tourism, which was 8%, it climbed it to 30%. Uh, and it helped us also to open the hotels from the, uh, to, and to expect when the tourists came. But also Dominicans, who we have two million Dominicans living in the United States, they were the first also to come as, as tourists to Dominican Republic. So the regional, a specific uh, a, and looking for a special uh, interest uh, on the local uh, markets, uh, you will see a whole matrix of uh, possibilities. Now we are seeing also on the younger generations the ecotourism. I mean, all the younger generation, they want to go to a hotel and they want to go if they, that hotel uses plastic or if that hotel has an organic restaurant. Uh, and, and that's also, I think, that everyone knows is, it's, it's a market that is, is growing. But also the typical market of sea and sun and beach is also there. But they also they are looking that if they go to a, one of our beach in Dominican Republic, they, they also want to go to Santo Domingo, which is the first city in America, where you have one of the biggest colonial uh, city in, in the whole uh, America. But they wanted also to go to an ecological park, uh, and they go there to, to the ecological uh, park, and we have, you have to have all these uh, several uh, markets because that's what people are looking. People are looking, as they describe here, for several uh, type of interests on ecological, on cultural, on historic. So everything that I've said here, it's hopes, but at the same time, we are living in a world that you cannot plan ahead. There is concern, times. Yeah. there is concern, and we have to plan um, on a time of uncertainty. I think that's a great summary because it pretty much sums up the complexity yeah. of the business that you're all working in. I have to say, whenever I talk to you guys, I'm just incredibly impressed by how you manage to ride out these uh, changing um, expectations from uh, your consumers. And uh, let's hope that you continue to go from strength to strength. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you. Thank you.